Let's take a look at how we can use Note to create flashcards from an existing file. We have the option to use a PDF file, a PowerPoint file, or a video or audio file that you may have on your computer. Under the flashcards menu, we're going to choose create from a PDF, PPT, or video slash audio. At this point, we can just drag and drop a file or click select file and navigate to where our file is located. I'm using as an example for mine a PDF file of some Spanish vocabulary. Once the file has been loaded, you click on the title area and you can adjust the title. It will default to the name of the file that you uploaded. Next, you'll choose the file format of what you're looking for. We're looking for flashcards at this point. You can select the language if necessary, the number of flashcards if necessary, the default setting is auto, but you could specify a specific number and the style of flashcards that you'd like. You can also customize what pages out of your file that was uploaded that you would like to incorporate. Click Save and Continue when complete and your flashcards will appear on the screen. Kai Complete is on the right side. If you would like to adjust that panel, you can click the double arrow button to shrink Kai Complete and maximize the space for your flashcards. Let's take a quick look at how Note can create flashcards from a PowerPoint presentation. As you can see on my screen, I have a short PowerPoint presentation with some slides with terms and definitions, as well as a few slides that I wouldn't prefer to have inside my flashcard set. Luckily, Note will be able to decipher between what should be relevant cards and which are ones to exclude. I'll create a flashcard set in the same method that I used before, except this time I'm going to upload my PowerPoint file. And now that my flashcard set is complete, you can see that again, it only took the relevant items from my PowerPoint presentation and turned them into a very useful flashcard set. Lastly, let's see how we can create a set of flashcards from uploading a video. And as you can see, it processed the video, created relevant flashcards based on the content in the video.